Dana, uh, pretty incredible night here at the Apex and a historical night. You bring in back the Ultimate Fighter. Let's start there. You got to see two finales. What did you think of uh, how, how things played out of, over the course of the season? Yeah, they did. They did. First of all, the season was a huge success. Um, number one. Number two, the finale was awesome. I mean, uh, you know, those kids fought their hearts out tonight. And, uh, you know, we, we, we got to see a couple of good uh couple of good fights yeah some good stories too i mean I, I i can't believe that brian battle walked into an mma gym five years ago without training anything and now here he is an ultimate fighter winner how crazy is that and how impressed are you by him yeah and a legit well-rounded fighter i mean the choke that he put in th then he's then he's technically explaining the choke and how he did it and yeah no he's impressive and i look forward to seeing him uh you know, and, 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 and what he's able to do here in the UFC. What do you think of Ricky, man? Just a character. He's obviously got a lot of, of people paying attention to him now. Do you think he's got, you, when you look at Ricky Tercios, you see, you see star power there for him? He's our Diego 2.0, you know what I mean? Uh, so, uh, you know, the cardio and, and the war that those two were in tonight um, was very impressive. I want to get to that main event, but let's uh, let's talk about what Daniel Rodriguez did tonight because the guy came in short notice, beat a guy in Kevin Lee who has fought for a championship before, took that fight on two weeks, and and that's already six wins now in the UFC in a span of 18 months. Can you put into context what we're seeing out of Daniel Rodriguez? I love guys who take risks. I love guys who 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 jump at opportunities, and I look for you know he he took this fight on two weeks notice, so you know the kid couldn't possibly be in the right kind of shape to take on a guy like Kevin Lee. But he came in and he sucked it up and he won the fight, clearly won the fight two to one. And uh, now people are probably going to be super excited to see what he looks like with a full camp against somebody else uh, of Kevin Lee's caliber. Yep. So looking forward to what's next for Daniel Rodriguez. And then how about Giga Shikadze tonight against Edson Barboza? I mean, it's one thing to go out and beat Edson Barboza. It's another thing to go out and beat him in the manner in which he did. Just your thoughts uh, watching that fight unfold. I've been geeking out over this fight for the last 45 minutes. And, um, you know, if you are a fan of this sport, if you are... Uh, you know, if you follow the sport and the media in any way, to be here tonight live and watch this fight was 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 one of those rare gifts those of us that are that are real fight fans get. And uh, you know, I love when a when a fight looks like it's supposed to be something on paper and then it ends up being exactly what you thought it was going to be. Yeah, and to me, it's just like, you know, you see these, 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 these nights where a guy, you know, he takes the next step in his career, he gets a big win. Tonight, Giga Chikadze, to me, looked like a guy who can win a championship. I mean, that, he is in that conversation. Is that how you're looking at him after tonight, or am I getting a little carried away with this one? Yeah, no, I mean, listen, th th it was number, th number nine versus number 10. He came out and looked very impressive. Let's not forget, this division is filled with nasty dudes. So, um, I don't know, I, I think that, as fight fans, we should all be excited about all the possibilities of matchups and, 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 uh, with him in this division. Yeah. All right, one more before I let you go. The train keeps on moving. Darren Till versus Derek Brunson next week. Give me your early thoughts on that matchup. It's a fun fight. Uh, it's going to be exciting to see Till back. You know, um, Brunson coming off his last win. Uh, you, you know, anytime Darren Till fights, you know, the, the week of will be exciting. I'm sure a lot of crazy things will be said, and the fight should be amazing. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.